Hi everyone, my name's Rachel and this is Adam Up. Adam Up, what are we doing today? We will explore ordinal numbers and words. They are used to describe the position of an object in an order. Here you can see people queuing for the bus. This man is at the front of the queue. He is in position one, so he is first. The next person is in position number two. They are second. The girl is in position number three. She is third. The lady behind her is in position number four, so she is fourth. The little boy is in position five, so he is fifth. And finally, the person at the end is in position six, so they are sixth. They are last in the line. We use ordinal numbers and language all the time, like when we describe the date or to say where someone came in a race. For the next activity, you will need 10 small toys or objects, 20 small squares of paper and a pencil. First, create your own set of ordinal word cards and number cards like this with first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth and tenth. Next, make a line of ten objects like this. Shuffle the cards you made earlier and then turn one over. I have turned over the word ninth. Now match the card to the object that is sitting in this position in the line. The word ninth means position number nine in the line. Count to find out which toy is sitting in this position. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This object is sitting in the ninth position of this line. The card goes here. Repeat the activity until every card has been matched. Pause the video now while you have a go. Welcome back. How did you get on? Sounds like you have been very busy. What ordinal number do you think comes after tenth? That's correct, it's eleventh. You did brilliantly and counted really carefully. For an extra challenge, why not reuse your ordinal word and number cards from the previous activity? Lay them face down and play a game of pairs. See if you can match the number card to the word card. Well everyone, it's time for us to go, but remember to keep practising because practice makes permanent. Bye for now! If you enjoyed this concept video, make sure to head over to our landing page where you will find videos from fully qualified teachers about English, maths and a whole range of foundation subjects. Twinkle Concepts. Concepts made clear.